This is a Fox News alert. Cindy Bur Senator Bernie Sanders has just released 10 years of his tax returns just before our town hall. Let's get some analysis quickly from Susan Lee of the Fox Business Network, joins us from New York. You've been looking over these for the past few minutes <laughs> yeah. since they came out. Susan, uh, top line analysis there? Okay, so I was sifting through the 2018 tax returns first off, and uh, Bernie Sanders paid an effective tax rate of 26%, which is much less the top tax bracket of these high earners. He should have paid 37%. And sifting through the details, it looks like most of that was accounted for as business income at 382000 of that 500000 plus. And that's being taxed at a lower rate, thanks to these new tax cuts by the Trump presidency. And also when it comes to charitable givings, I was looking at 18000 but uh, there's also a carryover of deductibles as well from 2017. So you can say that Bernie Sanders uh, effectively gained from the tax cuts thanks to President Trump. But also he re reported a million dollars in earnings in 2016, 2017 as well. So uh, that's pretty significant given that a lot of these proceeds came from the selling of his book in 2016 called Our Revolution. So those are some of the highlights so far sifting through these 10 years of tax returns. Brett, back to you. And just quickly, Susan, he did take the deductions yeah. um, for that were enabled from the, the new tax cuts. Yeah, that's right. So effectively, most of his income in 2018, he only paid 26 percent. Most of that income is considered business income, which is taxed in the 20 percent range instead of the 37 percent, which is what high earners above 500,000 should be paying. So, yes, there is definitely a benefit here for Vermont Senator Bernie Sanders. Okay, uh, Susan Lee in New York, we appreciate that quick analysis and, analysis and turnaround.